Attorney Nick Alcock, I want to speak a little bit about the DUI holiday task forces uh, that just started right now. And what it means is that on a probably Friday, Saturday, you're going to see a really uh, market increase in DUI patrols. Uh, the police officers are going to be looking for any type of violation that they can see, be it a civil traffic violation, an equipment failure, anything that would give them the right to pull somebody over, that's what they're looking for. Uh, I definitely urge people to avoid Scottsdale Road. Uh, any type of place uh, such as downtown Phoenix, uh, downtown Scottsdale where there's a, a very large number of bars and restaurants, stay away from those areas because really that's where the DUI patrols are likely to be. Uh, we don't really know where they're going to be and, and what's going to be happening. We know there are going to be many, many vans out and uh, you just have to be aware of the fact that police officers are going to be pulling people over right and left. Uh, they're going to be looking for you know, people driving late at night. They're going to be looking for people uh, driving in the vehicle filled with people. Obviously, any type of loud music, anything that will grab a police officer's attention is going to receive quite a bit of scrutiny. And I'm seeing a lot of DUIs where people are driving along perfectly fine, but let's say there's a minor equipment violation or there's a problem with the license plate, the license plate is suspended, the tags are suspended, something like that, and a police officer is going to pull you over and going to initiate a DUI investigation. Uh, if you do get pulled over and you feel like you're over the legal limit, just say you'd like to speak with an attorney right off the bat. Don't say anything about how much drink, you know, drinking you've been doing, how much alcohol is in your system, and police officers will ask you this question on a scale of 0 to 10 or a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being very impaired and, and 0 or 1 being not impaired at all. Where do you rate yourself? A lot of people will say there are 2 or 3, but they're not even impaired by alcohol. They don't feel impaired by alcohol, but they don't say that they're a 0 or a 1. It's a loaded question, and a lot of those questions that the police officers are going to be asking are loaded and, and kind of the fix is in. So if you get pulled over, ask to speak with an attorney. If you have any questions about DUI, 602-989-5000 is our number. We're happy to answer any questions that you have about a DUI case here in Arizona. Thanks so much.